Veteran actress and entertainer Mary Twala has been laid to rest. Close family and friends paid tribute to Twala at her funeral service in Soweto earlier today. She's been described as a professional storyteller with a great work ethic. Twala died last Saturday, days after she was admitted to a hospital in Johannesburg. An emotional send-off to an actress which graced local television screens. The venue was filled with flowers, according to her dying wish. Due to COVID-19 regulations, the millions of hearts that were touched by Mam Mary Twala's passing could only join the funeral proceedings virtually. Colleagues and friends remembered the icon through a string of video messages. What's up, my heart? Joey, Mary Twala. I was around 13, 14 when I saw her in Lifa at Uncle Tom's Hall. Early 70s. And then in the 90s, I reconstructed that play. And then saw her in last year's film, 50 years later. That's what distinguishes artists. You see, stars expire. Artists live forever. May her soul rest in peace. I just want to take this moment to pay my last respects to Mama Mary Twala, Robalaka Kozo Mama. You'll always be loved and missed. We'll remember you always. Who's 17 in this industry? From those days, the apartheid until was Wapel apartheid until Nanam Sanje, a artist is still working under those conditions. So, Zazio. You survived, you worked until the last day. You are a real legend. Sukshailin de Shane Mama, Sakshonipa, Pumula, Lalangopolo, Osishele Iligas. We are following in your steps. Often when we were casting, we'd say, mm, Mary could do that, and she could. But the thing is, there would be pretty much nobody else that could do that role the way that she could. She was a completely unique being. And there are very few people like that in the world. We were privileged to have her on Zone 14. Her son, Somi Zimthong Omdawung, thanked the country for appreciating his mother's contribution to the arts. I'm so at peace with what my mother has achieved. She's seen me walking down the aisle. She's seen her granddaughters. She's seen her sisters, her families. She loved her family. Her family loved her. I would like to thank South Africa as well for really loving my mother. A lot of people, when their parents, especially in the show business, when they pass on, they still have that pain that our parents were not appreciated. I would be lying if I say my mother was not appreciated. MLA, Wesley, you guys, you have done amazing for my mother. Thank you. South Africa, you have shown my mother the presidency and the president. You have really given my mother flowers when she, she could still smell them. Mampenga, as she was affectionately known, will make a final appearance on local screens in an upcoming and critically acclaimed film titled This is not a burial, it's a resurrection. This was one of her last film roles. Nasipa Mnube, SABC News, Johannesburg.